Uh, Russell Westbrook became only the second man in NBA history to reach 40 triple doubles in one season. Joining, of course, the great Oscar Robertson. Uh, although it came in a losing effort against the Charlotte Hornets. And um, I'm pretty sure that Russell Westbrook would prefer, much prefer that his team have won rather than him just getting this triple double. Uh, but individually, at least, Russell Westbrook shined today. He had 40 points. Um, 40 points, I believe 13 rebounds and 10 assists. And uh, I think he's. My math may be off, but I think he's tied now with James Harden for uh, the most 40-point triple-doubles in the season. Uh, I think so. I haven't really been keeping track of that, but I know he was only like one or or so behind him in that statistic. Um, But with this game, um, I I think it's pretty much, like I said in a video I did uh, a couple days ago, I think it's pretty much a certainty now that Russell Westbrook is going to win this MVP. Now, there's going to be some people who feel traditionally the MVP should go toward a player who, um, maybe like a Kylie Leonard, who some feel is a better overall player on both sides of the court and on a better team like the San Antonio Spurs. And, you know, I see a, a extreme. I see a very good case for that, you know. Um, but it sure would be uh, disheartening to see a guy like Westbrook, who was shortchanged during the All Star game, to also not receive any type of recognition whatsoever for having the type of season he's having. And, you know, I see some people say things, you know, about how some things he's doing this year are overrated. I mean. If it's so overrated, then how come we've never seen this happen before? I mean, and we've seen players who are capable of averaging triple doubles. Uh, I'm not just talking about um, with blocks, you know. We've seen players who are capable of this. We've seen players uh, like a LeBron James, and we've seen players like a... um, and Magic Johnson, I, who I guess was the closest we've seen to doing it, but we haven't seen it before. So I think it should, still should be uh, acknowledged for what he's done. You know, are some of the things he's doing overstated at times? Yeah, he's getting help to an extent with the you know with box out by his bigs as far as rebounders, but he still has to get those rebounds. Okay, so. That's just my opinion, you know. That's just me. But tell me what you guys think.